Peekaboo. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Lightning and I am one crazy bitch. Nuh uh, we trying to keep it family friendly up in here. I don't know swearing on my channel no more. Alright, I'm gonna try really hard not to swear. Let's see how many times I can not swear. So in today's video, I thought I would talk to you guys about the PlayStation 5. As you know, the PlayStation 5 has been revealed, so to speak. And from what I'm hearing, it is supposed to be backwards compatible with PlayStation 1 through 4. So you can enjoy all your games on one console. But before we start today's video, I'd like you guys to go down and hit the like button and subscribe to my channel and turn on the bell so that way you get notified whenever I make a new video. Let's get back into the video. So a lot of people have mixed emotions about the PlayStation 5, and I'm here for it. I honestly would love for games to come out for it that are new, but at the same time, older games. Today I'm going to be talking to you guys about what games I think they should possibly remake for the PlayStation 5, and or new games that should come out for the PlayStation 5. Here we go. So right off the bat, I just want to say that when Spyro and Crash Bandicoot came out again with the Insane Trilogy and the Reignited Trilogy, people lost their... Alright, that's one. People lost their minds over it. I lost my mind over it. Are you kidding me? You know how long I waited for this to happen? When they announced the Crash Bandicoot one, I was so excited because I'm like, yes, Spyro's next, Spyro's next. And it never came. And then one day, I was on the Twitter, tweeting my heart out, and I saw Toys for Bob posted. They're like, oh, guess what? We're redoing Spyro. And I went, ah! ah! I was so excited. I could not wait for that to happen. Now, I'm not saying that they should redo them again because it was already done and they did it perfectly. What I am suggesting is maybe remake these three games, please. Make them pretty. The Legend of Spyro trilogy got such a bad rap in the last game and I personally fucking loved it. That's two. I really liked it. I think it was good story. I think it was good gameplay. I really enjoyed it. I would love Toys for Bob to literally redo it. Maybe add more to it because they did leave the trilogy off with an opening to make a fourth one. We were supposed to have a Spyro movie, but that shit got canceled due to Skylanders. We don't talk about this. I've not played Skylanders. I refuse to play Skylanders. It looks like such crap, but apparently a lot of people like it. All I know is Spyro did not stay in there for very long. Leave these alone. They're garbage. Excuses for Spyro. Utter trash. But I would love for them to maybe make more Spyro games. Not necessarily a continuation of the original three because those are the original homie G3. I don't want them to make more of the original games. I really think that they need to focus on new storylines and new plots and new characters. Make it kind of like an original Spyro game but also make it different for the newer generation. Because now the newer generation is now getting experience in these games because of the Reignited and the Insane Trilogy. Same thing with Crash Bandicoot. Like Cortex, yeah, he's like the main villain in all of the games for Crash Bandicoot, and I know they've done more for PlayStation 2, I haven't really dabbled in those. All I'm saying is a lot of people like them, I like them, I enjoy playing them. Please make more! Please. Maybe introduce new characters, because if I have to hear Ripto's bitch ass one more time, I might implode. They've overused Ripto, I really think that they need to cancel him, shut him down, throw the whole devil away. What I'm also hoping happens is, I don't know if you guys play Final Fantasy, and if you do, smash the like button. I've noticed that they have been remastering almost every single Final Fantasy game that they can possibly touch up. I've noticed that they have been remastering almost every single Final Fantasy game that they can possibly touch up. When Final Fantasy X slash X2 remaster came out, oh my god, we lost our shit. My dad pre-ordered that for my birthday and I had a countdown calendar. I was so excited for that game and it was so good. They did such a good job with it. I heard a rumor. I was so excited for that game and it was so good. They did such a good job with it. I heard a rumor. 10-3. That's all I'm going to say. We can make a separate video about that. Leave a comment if you want me to make a video about 10-3. But what I have been noticing is, like I said, they are remastering them. What I really think that they need to focus on before even thinking about 10-3. If you want to introduce your games to the newer generation, because the newer generation is now playing like the 10 remaster, the 13 trilogy, 14 and 15, Dissidia, the 12 remaster, the 8 remaster. I have an idea. Maybe go back to Final Fantasy 1. Hear me out. If they create a brand new Final Fantasy game with the story and plot and characters as Final Fantasy 1, it would introduce a whole new generation of whole Final Fantasy things. Because let's face it, I'm 22, okay? I grew up playing Final Fantasy, I think 10 was my very first game. 
But I did go back to Final Fantasy 7, 8, 6, 5 because I do enjoy those nostalgic games. I grew up playing PlayStation 1 games just like you, Parasite Eve, Spyro, Crash. I grew up playing those as well. I have been trying to get my sister to play Final Fantasy 7 and she is the biggest fan of Final Fantasy 10. Like, I take credit for that. And she said no because it looks like roadblocks. Bitch, watch your mouth. Three. But if they could just start from one and maybe work their way up before continuing on the series. Like, I know that's a lot and I know it probably won't happen, but a bitch can wish. Four. Oh, damn. Oh, damn. Five. I should just stop talking. But if they could just remake them from, like, one up, they would introduce a new generation. And on top of that, we would start playing it. You'd have so many more customers, so many more downloads. I would just... I also think it's kind of a good idea to remake Assassin's Creed 1, 2, and 3. Don't come for me. They were good games for the time. They need updating. I'm not saying Assassin's Creed's a bad, like, you know, trilogy or whatever. The, one, the first three. The first one was a good story, good characters. I really didn't like the fact that it didn't have trophies because I'm a completionist and, you know, I'm a whore for trophies. And it didn't have any. They didn't introduce trophies until Assassin's Creed 2. I just, I kind of really want them to bring the trophies into it and maybe, like, touch up the graphics. Final Fantasy XIII, y'all can drag me if you want. Final Fantasy XIII was the best looking game for PlayStation 3. I don't care what you say. It was the most gorgeous game for the time, but the resolution and the games went down as the games progressed. I really think remastering the third one or just redoing it completely, redo Lightning Returns, then come talk to me. Cause honestly, I loved it. It was a great game. I love the ending to it. If you take the time to read the data log, it's really not that confusing of a story. Don't get me wrong, I had to like read the data log like three times to understand what was going on, but at the same time, did you forget how to read? I also think maybe remake the God of War games for one, two, and three. Like four was awesome. I kind of want to see what Kratos would look like and all the villains would look like, like if they redid it for PlayStation 5. And then as we know, Overwatch 2 was announced. Now I don't know if Overwatch 2 is going to be for PlayStation 4 or 5. Either one I'm good for. I plan on buying the PlayStation 5 when it comes out, but I have to take out a small loan with my bank. Saw Tie the Ties, Mania, and Tigers getting a reboot or a reignite, whatever. It's it's getting redone from what I'm seeing. I also would not be against Parasite Eve being re like redone. It was a good game for the time. I got confused and didn't make it very far, but I was also like five. But anyway, guys, that's it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, make sure you hit the like button down below and comment what games you want to see being made or remastered for PlayStation 5. Are you excited about PlayStation 5? Is it, do you think it's a waste of money? Answer me this. If you take one thing from this video, all I want you to do, comment down below. Do you plan on buying the PlayStation 5 or do you think it's just a huge waste of money when you have all four systems or just the four or the three or the two or the one? As always, I love you guys so much. Please go down below, like the button, you know, hit that like button. Comment, turn on the bell so you get notified whenever I make a new video. Follow me on all my social medias down below. They are all listed and also my vlog channel is listed down below. I will have vlogs out more often now, especially with the whole moving thing. I'm going to be filming less for you guys. I'm going to actually film like five videos today and then they'll be uploaded continuously. But anyway guys, I love you guys so much. Thank you guys for watching and I will see you guys next time. Bye.